He said a couple times there in the second half, you guys were able to, to chip away at the lead, get it down into the single digits, but it seemed like every time, almost as soon as you would, right back down the floor, Baylor had something for you guys on the other end. Just how frustrating was it not quite being able to, to get over that hump this evening? Oh, it was frustrating, but uh, you know, I credit Baylor. Um, they're a great team. You know, they hit a lot of outside shots tonight, and you know, they killed us on the offensive glass, so um, you know, that's unacceptable. That's one of those kind of unique lineup where they have it smaller, a little bit quicker. Different from any other Big 12 team you guys have seen so far this year? Um, in the way, just in the way they kind of tackle a game or use their strategy? Not really. I feel like, um, you know, every team in the Big 12 is, you know, good and, you know, can play like that. Um, you know, so, uh, like I said, I credit Baylor and, you know, they just came out ready to play. And, um, you know, they just, just our effort is. So when you guys went to that press, how did it help you guys get back into the game? Um, Sped them up. Uh, you know, we got them uncomfortable, and um, you know, we got them throwing the ball everywhere. We, you know, ran through the ran through a couple steals, and you know, got layups. But um, you know, it's just unfortunate that we didn't come out to the first half like that. You guys have had success on the glass this year, Derek, especially. What was different tonight? Just how physical they were down low. Um. You know, like I said, our effort. Um, you know, we didn't really come out ready to play and uh, kind of dwelled on our last one against Kansas. So, um, you know, we just got to get back, get back in the gym and, you know, get ready for Tennessee. You mentioned that maybe you guys dwelled on the Kansas game a little too long. How do you avoid maybe dwelling on, on this one not going your way with Tennessee coming up this weekend? Uh, we know it's a great, um, you know, bounce back. Um, you know, they're number one in the country now. And, you know, we feel like when we're playing and, you know, when we locked in, we could compete with anybody. And, you know, um, I feel like it's a great, great opportunity coming up. Um, you know, we just got to work hard and practice and, you know, just, just lock in for this week.